A topless event set for next month already has a thousand RSVPs on Facebook, but the organizer of the event tells me they have several hurdles to face before they can show some skin. Being an interest uh, is a, definitely a feeling of freedom. John Palm is not a shy man. To be out without any need to cover and feel ashamed, it's a sense of self-confidence. Palm, who identifies as a naturalist or nudist, is the president and co-founder of Tampa Area Naturalist, or TAN. The nonprofit has organized an event called Top Free Equality Day, set for August 25th. Women are looking for a, 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 an achievement of equality. They, they, they don't want to be discriminated against. They want to have the same right to, to enjoy the beach without a top the same as a man can. The topless event set for Honeymoon Island has been approved by the Florida the Division of Recreation and Parks, but the Tampa area naturalists believe the cost behind the event will leave them with a bare wallet instead of skin. The permit fee itself they want $500 for. Off-duty rangers for the day they'd like $560. It's also a re requirement for a million dollar insurance policy for the day which will run about $400. The group would also be required to purchase privacy screens, which would cost another $300. We're hoping that they'll waive the fees. If not, we may uh, do some kind of fundraiser to cover it because there is a tremendous amount of interest uh, in this event. The Top Free Equality Day Facebook event already has over 1,000 RSVPs, and TAN's Change.org petition to establish a clothing optional section of beach in the Tampa Bay area has almost 15,000 signatures. Florida law allows for women to be top free. The park code is not allowing for uh, women to be top free, and we're looking for a change in the park code. In Tampa, Serafina Brooks, 8 on your side.